Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net, and in this tutorial, I'll show you how to create a mirror image of your hard drive C. Now, before we start, we need to make sure that you have a partition already created. The reason for this is because it's a little harder if you create a partition via Ghost, so this way is much easier. So let's begin. Go ahead and uh, right-click Computer and click on manage then click on disk management I have already created my partition here my partition is D now keep in mind that I only have one hard drive drive 0 so I'm gonna back up my drive C into my drive D I'm sorry I'm gonna create a mirror image Now if you don't have one, you can always create one. Make sure that when you create a partition, you create it big enough so you can fit the operating system. It doesn't need to be the same size as your, as your hard drive. It just needs to be big enough so you can fit the operating system. You can name it however you like. I prefer Ghost and if you backing if you're doing a an image of windows 7 it is recommended that you use 16 gigs not 10 like you see here but since i have all my uh partition already created i'm not going to follow through so i'm going to cancel i'm going to close here and then restart my computer using ghost Now keep in mind that for this tutorial I'm um, using virtual PC. That's the reason why you see the mouse like in the center moving around. So I'm practically doing a ghost uh, backup and all that throughout the virtual PC. Now go ahead and click OK and we're gonna uh, do an image of my local partition to a partition. Remember drive C to drive D. And everything is inside drive 0. Now the source is the hard drive. So I only have one hard drive. So this is going to be my source hard drive. And now this is the source of the partition. This is where I have my operating system right here. this is my drive C. I apologize that I didn't put any name. I should have put some uh, name here. Go ahead and select it and click OK. And now here is the the destination. Again, this is the hard drive destination since I only have one. Only one shows up. Click OK and here is the destination partition this is the partition I created remember you can create it also NTFS and here click yes to proceed uh, with partition copy and it's copying the content from drive C to drive D all of it. Click reset computer to restart. The advantage of this is is that you can restore your system from that uh, partition which is much faster than a CD for example. Rebooting now. Once it reboots I'm gonna go to my uh, drives and put them side by side so you can see that it created an identical copy of my hard drive. Click start, right click computer and click on manage. I have now my drive C and my drive D. I'm gonna open both
here it is both of them have the same information and both of them have the same master boot record so that means I can boot from my ghost backup if in the future my drive C goes bad I can I can always boot my system from drive D thank you for watching this video my name is Miguel feel free to email me if you have any questions